Christopher Reeves. Superman. I don't know if I'm going to be emotionally ready to watch this trailer. I was, a, you know, I remember when that terrible accident happened. I remember um, the news airing it. I mean, it was on all, it was on Channel 7 News, Channel 9 News, Channel 2 News. And it's in, you know, in Chicago. So those are, uh, were the news channels. And I was in, I was in disbelief. I couldn't believe it. I just could not believe it because Superman when you were a kid and you see this man flying through the air you know how we all as you know kids dreamed about flying and Superman for me he was the best he was the best and not because of you know just Superman Christopher Reeve you know, I knew what that man stood for. You know, he's a family man, patriarch. You know, he did, you know, things for charity. He actually cared about people. And I just don't think I'll be ready for I'm not, I don't think I'm going to be ready for this trailer. I heard it's very, you know, it's a tearjerker. Even though it's just a trailer. You know, a lot of people say uh, YouTubers are, you know, maybe doing that fake shit just like uh, celebrities, you know, and movies. You know, how they can, you know, have to act just to, you know, make the movie, you know, better. And you got to, you know, do your role. You know, they say a lot of YouTubers are like that, in which I agree. There are a lot of fake YouTubers out there who put on an act just for people to watch them. It's no act here. None at all. I don't have to be fake. I don't have to lie to y'all about anything. If I get emotional because this is really touching me in a way, you know, that it's, I'm pretty sure it's touched a lot of people around the world. It's very emotional. This is going to be very, very emotional. I'm not going to, you know, throw on these uh, headphones and get ready for it. So without further ado, before we get into this, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. You know your boy trying to get to 10K subscribers. You know, it's late at night. It's 1 o'clock, y'all, so I'm trying not to be too loud because I got my daughter over here sleeping. Knocked out, and I definitely want to wake her up. <laughs> All right, let's do this because any little noise can wake this girl up. I'm telling y'all. Y'all know how Chloe get down. For everyone who's been following me since the beginning, y'all know about my daughter, Chloe. I've been having her on here since day one. Y'all already know. But let's do this. This is the trailer for Superman, the Christopher Reeve story. <sighs> All fucking ready. All ready. I, I should have known they was going to start off with the Superman uh, music. <clears throat> Everybody... Everybody's looking for a hero. I am not a hero. That was a part. I played the part. I'm not that man. Hands down, he was Superman from day one. I realized that if I could pull off this part, it would change my life. John Hausman said, Mr. Reeve, it is very important to become a serious classical actor. Unless, of course, they offer you a load of money to do something else. <laughs> He convinced me when I first met him that he would fly. Doing things with my dad, it was all about activity and action. Riding bikes, playing soccer, skiing. My dad was very competitive and he didn't necessarily slow down. We said goodbye and he gave this wave. That was the last time I saw him on his feet. <laughs> Mr. Reeve currently has no movement or spontaneous respiration. Superman, crazy. Just that simple little thing over the horse. I'd ruined my life and everybody else's. I won't be able to ski, sail, throw a ball to Will. 
won't be able to make love to Dana. Maybe we should let me go. She came flying in, and she just yelled, I love you. I love you. And then she said the words that saved my life. You're still you, and I love you. He and Robin were such good friends because they could match each other. Robin also had struggles that he dealt with his whole life, and I think that they... I knew about uh, Robin Williams and uh, Christopher Reed friendship, but when he passed away, um, Robin Williams actually spoke on it. And so I'm well aware of what Robin Williams, how close he was to Christopher Reed, but I'm pretty sure this is going to show a lot more that we didn't know about. They both were he and Robin were such good friends because they could match each other. Robin also had struggles that he dealt with his whole life, and I think that they both were aware of darkness. Brother Chris is fighting like crazy. When you find people who fight like that but still keep their humanity, that gives you great hope. That is tough because I can feel him, but he can't feel me. It must have been hell for my mom, too, knowing what she had lost. God, hold on gives you great hope. That is tough because I can feel him, but he can't feel me. It must have been hell for my mom, too, knowing what she had lost. That guy looked just like him. Oh, my God. Why isn't he playing the Superman role? Oh, my God. That is, that is Superman right there. What the hell is Hollywood thinking? This is Superman. This dude looks just... Oh, my God. He'll be a perfect fit. I felt I needed to do something not just for myself, but for everyone else in the same condition. The fact that Superman was in a wheelchair and was willing to go public with it was huge. Help is on the way. The Christopher and Dana Reeve Paralysis Act People are literally walking because of him. What is a hero? My answer was that a hero is someone who commits a courageous action without considering the consequences. Now my definition is completely different. I think a hero is an ordinary individual who finds the strength to persevere and endure in spite of overwhelming obstacles. I wouldn't have missed this for the world. and Dana Reed Foundation. I knew about that foundation. It's a lot I knew about Christopher Reed. And it's a lot I didn't. But oh my God. You can feel the love from his family. And you can feel the pain in their hearts. You, I mean, you can just feel it. And if you can't, then you're not a human being. I'm gonna, I'm, you know, I'm going to admit, I didn't like Superman 3. I love 1, and 2 was my absolute favorite. 4 was good with uh, Ultraman. I, I believe that was his name, He, the guy he fought against. I just didn't like 3 that much. I mean, Richard Pryor, he was hilarious. I mean, he stole the movie, of course. Y'all don't know who Richard Pryor is. Go do your uh, research on him. One of the greatest to ever do it as far as comedy, even if, you know, his movies, great movies, but, um, I didn't too much like Superman 3, I mean, Chris Reed did a lot of other movies, but that's just what he's known for, and he's always gonna be known for Superman, to me, he's still by far the best Superman, no one has came close, no, I don't believe no one can come close to, uh, portraying Superman like Chris Reed, he, I mean, he just had the look, the charisma, he was just perfect. You know, he had the height, he had the perfect build. 
you know, that, that smile to go with it. He, he was just Superman. And I'm definitely going to watch this. I'm going to bring some Kleenex with me. I don't know if I'm going to bring a date because I don't want my date to see me crying. You know what I'm saying? That ain't going to happen. No, I'm just joking. I'll cry in front of anybody. I don't care who I'm in front of. But uh, I hope y'all enjoyed this and I hope y'all intend on watching this. You know, support Christopher Reed, support his family, and let's go. So thank y'all, and as always, see y'all on the next video. Peace, love, and deep sad.